Desculpa. Que acender a luz, né? You must be good. It's our challenge here on Earth. You are the salt of the Earth. And if the salt is tasteless, with that, shall it be salted? Is it good for nothing else but to throw itself out and to be trampled by man? You are the light of the world. A city built on a hill cannot be hidden. Nor do you light a lamp and put it under a bushel, but on a candlestick and give light to everyone in the house. Let your light so shine before men, that they many see your good works and glorify your Father which is in heaven. Think not that I am come to destroy the law of, or the prophets. I have not come to destroy, but to fulfill, for truly I say to you, until heaven and earth pass away, one jot or one title will by no means pass from the law until it's fulfilled. Whoever therefore breaks one of these commandments, however little, and teaches men so, shall be called, listen, the kingdom of heaven. But whoever does and teaches them will be called great in the kingdom of heaven. For I say to you, unless your righteousness exceeds that of the scribes and Pharisees, you will by no means enter the kingdom of heaven. You have heard that if it was said of, to the ancients, those shall not kill, but whoever kills will be liable to judgment. But I say to you that whoever is angry with his brother without cause will be liable to judgment. And whoever shall say to his brother, Raka, shall be liable to San Sanhedrin. And whoever says to him, Fool, will be liable to the fire of hell. Therefore, if you bring your gift to the altar, and there remember that your brother has something against you, leave your gift there before the altar and go, first and reconcile to your brother. And then come and present your gift. Agree with your adversary quickly, while you are on the way with him, lest your adversary deliver you to the judge, and the judge deliver you to the official, and you be put in prison. Truly I say to you, you will never get out of there until you have paid the last penny. Ye have heard that it was to say of those of old, thou shall not commit adultery. But I say to you that whoever looks at a woman to lust after her was ready committed, after has her has already committed adultery with her in her in his heart. Therefore, if your right eye causes you to stumble, pluck it out and throw it away from you. For it is better for you that one of your members should be perished than that your whole body should be thrown into hell. And if your right hands offend you, cut it off and throw it away from you. For it is better for you that one of your limbs should perish than that your whole body be thrown in hell. It was also said, whoever leaves his wife, give her a bill of divorce. But I say to you, that whoever divorces his wife, except on the ground of fornication, makes her commit adultery, and whoever marries a divorced woman commits adultery. Moreover, you have heard that it was said to those of old, Thou shalt not swear, but shall fulfill thy oaths of the Lord. But I say to you, do not swear at all, nor by heaven, because it is the throne of God, nor by the earth, for its full stall, nor by the Jerusalem, for it's the city of the great king, nor shall you swear by your head, for you cannot make a hair white or black, but let your speech be, yes, yes, no, no, for anything more than this is of evil origin. 
You have heard that it was said, a eye for an eye and a tooth for a tooth. But I say to you, do not resist the evil one. But if anyone strikes you on the right cheek, often offer him the other also. And whoever wants to sue you and take your tunic, let him also have your cloak. And if any forces you to go a mile, go with him too. Give him who asks you and do not turn away from him who wants to lend him. You have heard that if that it was said, Thou shalt love thy neighbor and hate thine enemy. But I say to you, love your enemies, bless them that curse you, do good to them that hate you, and pray for them which despitefully use you and persecute you, that you may need, that you may be children of your Father which is in heaven. For he makes his sun rise on the evil and on the good, and sends rain on the just and the unjust. For if you love those who love you, what reward will you have? We hope one day to be together in happiness in the Father's house.